So for this kinesiology taping procedure, we're looking at the rotator cuff, and you can utilize these techniques for um, most of the three rotator cuffs on the back, looking at supraspinatus, infraspinatus, and teres minor. Uh, we do not go over anything that would do subscap, as it would be hard to work through the axilla. Uh, but what you're going to be looking to do is help guide those muscles and really make sure that you're covering the whole length of the muscle and really looking at the insertion point, which obviously will be covered by the deltoid, but we still want to make sure that we're getting over that far to help mimic the motion of what that muscle is trying to accomplish. So we'll start with our anchor strip, and for this one we're doing supraspinatus, so we'll attach just over on the superior side of the shoulder, going out to lateral deltoid, and applying our tension, then working back up over and kind of behind the acromion and then over the spine of the scapula and then laying down with that tension and then putting a nice and loose anchor strip. For this one, we're doing more of an infraspinatus, so we're getting all the way to the lateral side of the deltoid as that muscle works as an external rotator. Lay down our anchor, peel back our backing, pull that tension on, pull it across. This we actually went probably a little far on the anchor as we're laying down on top just off of the medial border of the scapula. So we're also going to demonstrate the decompression strips and you can use this along um, any point of the muscle uh, from discussions with other uh, physios and athletic trainers. These are very beneficial for trigger points uh, within these muscles so it's something that you could utilize with and also again just to help reduce pain. Uh, as with all our other videos, the same principles apply, tearing from the middle, applying tension all the way through the strip of tape, laying it down evenly, from, working out from the middle out, and then gently laying down those two anchors. For this one, we went directly across, and we'll put on one diagonal strip. Again, you could add more if needed, and based on what your clinical outcomes are going to be.